What's up everybody? In today's video, we're gonna cover this right here. It's another Force Link 2.0 vehicle with figures, the Enfys Nest from the movie Solo. We also got a little bit of news for you. Check it out. What's up everybody and welcome back to Pop Empire. We're happy to have you here. Like I said, we're gonna cover this right here. It is another Force Link 2.0 vehicle, just like the one we did in the last video. However, this one is Enfys Nest from also the movie Solo. Also comes with the speeder bike or it's actually called what? A swoop bike. So pretty cool. After we get into this, we'll let you in on that little bit of news that we got for you. It's actually very interesting news. So stay tuned for that. All right, let's get into this. So before I jump in and take this out of the box, I do just want to point out a few things. Now this was another deal that we scored at Ross. We actually got this for $6.99. So definitely a great deal. Probably a lot cheaper than it was new in store. I did notice though, they don't go for too much online, but it's definitely a cool vehicle. So if you're looking for one, maybe check out your local Ross and maybe you'll score a deal on one too. Now, as you look at the front here, it has the bubble here and you can see the figure. She also comes with a weapon. As we take a look at the back, it just shows what you get in the box, which is the swoop bike and fist nest, the weapon, and then it also discusses force link a little bit more on the top. So I'm gonna go ahead, we're gonna get into this, we're gonna check it out. So here it is out of the box. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at the Enfys Nest figure. Very awesome figure. This is actually one of my favorite characters from the Solo movie. Unfortunately, she wasn't in it very much, but just getting into some of the detail here, she has this fur that goes around her neck here. She actually does have a cloth cape, which I really appreciate. And then just these other details going on in front and here on the chest. Also these pieces on her arms. And also just checking out the helmet. It doesn't come off or anything, but again, really awesome figure. And then here's the weapon also that goes along with the figure. Now just getting into the vehicle, very awesome looking, a lot of detail going on in here. Kind of reminds me of like a chopper. But down here on the bottom, there's pedals. There's a handbrake right here. Uh, this fin going on back here. And then you just have more detail going on back here. And overall, it's just a really awesome vehicle. And then as we get into the front, there's these rudders or, or sails. And they also have these little designs on each one, which actually each one is different. So that's really cool. The only other way you could actually get this vehicle, they do make it in the Black Series collection. But this one of course goes with the three and three fourths figure. So if you do have the vintage collection figure, I think it would go very well with this swoop bike. So definitely one to check out. So yeah, that vehicle is pretty awesome. Uh, the movie Solo came out with a lot of cool action figures and toys, vehicles, things like that. Uh, again, if you have a Ross near you, definitely go check it out. Uh, even Burlington Coat Factory, we've definitely found some stuff there as well. Sort of the same kind of deals. So Ross, Burlington Coat Factory, those kind of places, go check them out. Never know what you might find. Now, before we get into that news, I just wanted to point out one more thing. Uh, for any of you that may be starting your own YouTube channel, maybe you already have a YouTube channel, and you're looking for music like we use on our videos that don't have copyrights, uh, you're not gonna get copyright claims and things like that, you're not gonna get in any trouble, we got the place for you. Go check out epidemicsound.com. I'll put the link down in the description below. As a matter of fact, if you click that link down below and you subscribe, you will get one month for free. So go check that out. Don't get in trouble. Use some amazing music. Their catalog is gigantic. There's so much music, there's sound effects, you name it. Like I said again, click that link down in the description below, get one month free, Epidemic Sound. Check it out. And we do have a bit of Star Wars news, but first, there was actually some news from NECA. I'm not sure if any of you collect NECA statues or figures or whatever, but we found out that as far as like the Ninja Turtle figures go, there is gonna be the Toka and Razar, Razar, to whatever, 
however you pronounce them, I don't know, from Turtles 2, Secret of the Ooze. Those are actually going to be released online. They're actually not gonna be up on, I don't think they're, they're gonna be up on Walmart at all, or Target. No, they're uh, totally bypassing uh, Walmart. Yeah, so they're gonna be on the NECA website uh, starting Friday until the following Friday. So you can get in your orders for that. They're trying to cut down on scalpers and things like that. So just wanna throw that in. No, it's not Star Wars stuff, but we know that you, know, you guys are collectors, so there's an opportunity for you there if that's something you're interested in. But like I said, we got some Star Wars news. And now this is an interesting tidbit of information that we just found out literally just today. And today's Wednesday. This video is going up today, Wednesday. We're just kind of cramming all this thing. Got to edit still after this and get it up. But I found this bit of news on JediBusiness.com that I found very interesting. And that is that the vintage collection Smuggler's Run Millennium Falcon from the Galaxy's Edge line that's going to be released at Target. They actually found out from a PR person within Hasbro that that is an online purchase only. That is not hitting stores physically. So right now, obviously, uh, the pre-orders are are all sold out. However, it's gonna go back up. That's that's not all of them. It will be back up, so just keep an eye on that. Probably when they, uh, you know, start shipping them again. When do they come out with the 30th of August? Yeah, 30th. So uh, yeah, maybe be checking back around then, even between now and then, obviously, but yeah, there you go. Online only, that's kind of crazy. And then one more bit of information that I also found on JediBusiness.com. If you're not checking out their website, make sure you do that. I'll go ahead and link them down in the description also. Interesting bit of information also regarding that same Millennium Falcon, and that comes with the Chewbacca and the Porgs that are inside and the porgs were learning that they aren't like the original porgs that came in their own little little box but they are however made off the same same sculpt or same same mold or whatever however only one of those porgs is the same as those porgs that you could get originally and the other ones all have different paint schemes and things so that's kind of interesting all different ones except the, the one little normal guy and then also it's not confirmed but it also seems that maybe the Chewbacca head sculpt is also new so just another thing another food for thought just another thing for all of us crazy collectors to add to the collection. So, I don't know. Maybe something you're gonna wanna look into for yourself. Now to watch a video that YouTube suggests for you, click that video right up there to your left. Watch our last video. It's gonna be that one right up there to your right. We'd also love it if you'd subscribe and to do that, hit that link right up above our heads. That would be fantastic. See y'all in the next video. Peace guys. See ya.